A person lets you in front of them in traffic. Your neighbor mows your lawn. Maybe a friend sends you a card in the mail. These are just a few examples of random acts of kindness. Oftentimes, small gestures, little effort, but they have a tremendous positive impact on the person on the receiving end. They are actions to be celebrated and shared. And with us this afternoon to help us with sharing these sentiments, Heather Brooks, who is a kindness commissioner and the new secretary of kindness for the city of Salisbury, along with mayor of Salisbury, Jack Heath. Welcome. Thank you for joining us this afternoon. Nice to be here. Thank you. It's great and to be here. And congratulations on your new positions. Yeah. Thank Mayor, you. Yeah. How, how you doing with that? I got it. You got, you got it? it? I got it. <laughs> I got it. Heather, this is brand new for you, too. It is. Yeah. I've been a commissioner for several years, but yeah. definitely a new role for me. Well, yeah. congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. All right. Well, let's, can you give us a general overview of the purpose of the Kindness Initiative? Sure. So the Kindness Commission was formed by Mayor Jake Day and Grace Murdoch. Um, really to focus on creating, recognizing, and inspiring kindness within our own community. And so there's approximately 15 members that are on the commission, and Jack has now just joined the commission as well. Um, so we're thrilled um, to have him as part of it, um, to lead the way to be able to spread kindness in our community. So next week is Random Acts of Kindness Week. Tell it us is. about that. It is. So it's a national um, event that takes place every year um, from February 12th through the 18th. And it just gives, it highlights the opportunity for those of us in the community to focus on others, mm -hmm. um, to bless others with acts of kindness, um, to promote self-kindness as well, because um, we can only be as kind as we are to ourselves. All right, so Heather, you brought props here. I Tell did. Tell us what you got. <laughs> so my first thing is, is that this is my act of kindness to you today. Um, so. Hearts equal oh, kindness, oh, 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 oh. and so as you can see, um, they have some delicious treats at the moment. So we're so appreciative for you and the time that you're taking, and for all that you do in the community. Thank so you. that's a little goody. I also brought some kindness keychains um, um, that my daughter made, Savannah, and then some little hearts, um, a kindness jar um, to help give you some ideas of ways that you can actually be kind. Those, that's pretty awesome. Why do you think it's crucial that we try to pay? kind actions forward in the community? Well, I, th I think personally, um, it fits our area. It fits the Eastern Shore. It yeah. fits Salisbury. Um, to give you an example, the other day, I pulled into a drive through coffee place coming back from Annapolis. I get to uh, Salisbury and I wanted a cup of coffee to, you know, to keep me awake. Right. And um, I pull up and the guy says, I, I handed him my credit card. He goes, no need the person in front of you covered you. But those kinds of little things are really what it's all about. Yeah. And they, those little things really can make your day, especially when no. you're told your coffee's paid for. I Absolutely. Mean, it's it, making somebody's day. Why do you think it's important to pay forward like that? Yeah, absolutely. And we have Vincente uh, at Together Cafe. You know, he's he's really takes care of the homeless and the people who really can't afford things. and. You, you watch how many people at the end when they get their change, a dollar, two dollars, whatever it is, and they say, here, put it in the bucket for the... That to me is defined Salisbury. Sure, sure. So random act of kindness is, a, I guess, our challenge, our goal to really push paying it forward? Absolutely. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. um, when I think about kindness, I think about how it can be transformative for a community. And you think of how that one act involves the giver, the receiver, and then it also involves those that witness the act of kindness. Mm -hmm. So your one act of kindness turns into basically touching three lives. Yeah. So it is transformative and that's why we need it. Um, and that's why it's important to pay it forward. All right. So. We're, we're issuing this challenge today to everybody. Yeah. Heather, so, Mayor, yeah. thank, you yes. so thank you so much, much for You're being welcome. here today. Well, it's a pleasure.